Karen, do you cleanse, and if so, how often? Once a year, I do a major cleanse, mm -hmm. and that uh, means that I stop talking mm -hmm. for 21 days. Mm -hmm. No phones, mm -hmm. no email, no talking to anybody. I close myself up in my house. Mm -hmm. um, I reduce and uh, retreat. Mm -hmm. No talking is the first and most important part of the cleanse, but I also reduce what I eat. Mm -hmm. um, I don't. I take all the salt out of my food. Mm -hmm. I take the oil out. I don't eat any grains. Mm -hmm. um, I don't eat any sweets, I have no caffeine, mm. and I just uh, meditate and, and do yoga asana and read good books <laughs> like the Bhagavad Gita and Yoga mm. Sutra and try to study things that will make me a better person. If you were going to advise anyone else to do a cleanse, what would be the three must-haves for an effective cleanse? Time, mm. uh, a desire to do it and a flexible work schedule. Hmm. What would you say then to people that say, I don't have time, I'm traveling too much? Uh, I think for an uh, effective retreat, you need to, to, to pull back hmm. and, and take that time away from just the normal day-to-day -day life. But look, if you can't do that, just eating a vegan diet is a mm. cleanse in itself. Vegan, eat vegan, turn upside down, um, sleep in a completely dark room. Mm. Meaning without light, cell phones, alarm clocks. Without the sunlight coming in, the moonlight coming in, neon signs, uh, electronic devices, turn it all off.